Hello and welcome to ChiefTutor.com, training videos in Chief Architect. Uh, a question was submitted on how to change uh, the floor heights uh, in an existing plan. Now here is an existing plan. I'm going to go up to the second floor. I'm just going to double click into one of the space. And we see that it's set to 8 feet on both floors. Both F and B is set to 8 feet. He would like to change it so it's 9 feet below and 8 feet foot above. Now you can do this one at a time in the specifications so you can just automatically type in like let's say we put 109 and an eighth here and I hit tab on the keyboard. This will adjust the plan so there is nine feet below and eight feet above. Well look at it, it actually changed it to 85 inches. So it compensated for the already existing roof that you have. So you have to manually then go into this and go 97 and one eighth inch and there you go and it forced it in but instead of going through the trouble of uh, making that happen through every little room the quick and easy solution is to go up to the defaults click on the defaults double click the floor and change it here and here it will show you again the first or the second floor and then the first floor so on the first floor we want to change it to 109 and an eighth hit tab and see it did adjust automatically so I'm just going to change this back to what I want it to be and there it is it's set to 8 feet here 9 feet here so this is now set up correct as the floor defaults I'm going to click OK and done and now you'll notice that each floor is already automatically set the correct way I'm going to each one and there it is I can even go downstairs and just double check my rooms. Here's my room, 109 and 8th, which is great. And so any room that you've changed manually uh, will get will not get changed because you've already changed it manually. But if you want to quickly switch it to what it should be, you just make sure there's default checks in all the room. I'm gonna go in here, all the defaults are checked, so it's good to go. It'll automatically set it to the way it was. So let's say this room was jacked up like at 84 inches or something. If I want to simply solve it, I would double click it and click on the default and it'll set it back to what it should be as it was registered in the defaults. So that's the simple and easy way to change your floor heights here in Chief Architect. And that rule applies for both Chief 10, X1, X2, and all future Chief versions.